Paul Claus and I'm the owner operator of Ultimate Thule Outfitters and Ultimate Thule Air Service and we live in the center of the largest national park in the world, Wrangell St. Elias. And the only way to get to our place is with an airplane and I fly every day. <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> Turbine Otter is, I think, the most fantastic, uh, of course you got to take in the prejudice factor, but stole aircraft ever made, short takeoff and landing. Uh, it's a work airplane, hauls big loads, almost uh, two tons. It's got a thousand horsepower dash 10 geared engine in it. Uh, this one is the first one that was converted to that uh, combination. And it is absolutely beyond imagination. I got 5,000 hours in this particular airplane and I still daily am amazed by it. It's just like, how does it do this? <laughs> so it's pretty fun. It's, I feel really fortunate to, to get to fly it. Send exhaust on a field approval. <clears throat> Whilst making that field approval, got this battery approved, even though I think you can do this as a minor. Uh, master relay, start relay. So all the heavy cables are on the front side now. Engine overhauled. Cowling made from scratch because the old one fell apart. <laughs> New firewall from Clyde Smith, the cup doctor. Uh, just an overhaul prop. Pitched at 58. 
Good. Hello again. <laughs> Panel from 50 50,000 2024 T3. Wrinkle finish, a little shock mounted six pack here. Uh, wood floors, leather seats, fabric Great. interior. Skylight from Steve's. No, yeah, that's Steve's aircraft skylight. <clears throat> Yeah, they used to do my annuals on my 170. <laughs> Got the trimmer fuel valve here, with, along with the trimmer fuel system. Uh, new handle, courtesy of an unnamed source. <laughs> uh, stretch the stock tri-pacer belly panel all the way back to the tail, so you can get up in there easy. And then there's a larger than normal access panel down there. Very incremental exploring with 